I am going to discuss about heat and in this video we are going to cover introduction, heat and its units, temperature and its units. Yeah. Heat. heat plays an important role in our life. Most of us use the word heat to mean something that feels warm. But science defines heat as the flow of energy from a warm object to cooler object. So simply we can say that heat is a form of energy. It flows from hot body to cold body. So whenever you touch a body, you will feel whether the body is either cool or hot. Just do one activity. Take a piece of wood and a piece of metal. You just place these two objects in fridge for 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, you just take them out. You feel they were cold when we touch them. When we touch metal piece or wooden piece, the heat energy is being transferred from our body to metal piece or wooden piece. So we can feel they are cold. We feel metal piece is colder than the wooden piece as more heat is transferred from our body to metal piece than wooden piece. Heat energy enters our body, we feel hotness. For example, when we bring our finger near candle flame, the heat energy transfers from candle flame to our body. When heat energy flows out of our body, we feel coldness. Touch a piece of ice, we feel cold as heat energy is being transferred from our body to metal piece. So, when heat energy enters into our body, we feel hotness. When heat energy flows out of our body, we feel coldness. So what are the effects of heat? It changes the state of matter, temperature, solubility of a substance, size of an object, color of the body, and volume of the body. Now, units. So what are the units of heat? The SI unit of heat is Joule. And its CGS unit is calorie. The one calorie is equal to 4.2 joules or 4.186 joules. Now the next topic is temperature. The degree of hotness or coldness. So the degree of hotness or coldness. But there is one more definition of temperature. That is, it is a measure of thermal equilibrium or units. So the unit of temperature is degree Celsius and in SI system, its unit is Kelvin. So there is a relation between degree Celsius and Kelvin. So zero degree Celsius is equal to 273 Kelvin. Temperature in Kelvin is equal to 273 plus temperature in degree Celsius. Using this formula, if they ask to convert degrees to Kelvin or Kelvin to degrees. Let us see one example. So convert 20 degrees Celsius into Kelvin. So you just add 273 to the degree Celsius that which they have given. So here they have given 20 degrees and to the 20 degrees we need to add 273. We will get 293 Kelvin. Antena. Inkin kawali.